Hello guys, welcome back to the Tenorshare channel. Apple recently released iOS 16. Many of you, I'm sure, can't wait to upgrade your device system. When you tap on download and install, and after waiting for the update to download, click the install now button, it would begin to verify the update. However, it appears that many people became stuck on the verifying update page and were unable to exit. It could be related to the busy Apple server at times. However, it can also be caused by other factors. So watch this video to learn how to fix this problem. Let's get started. When you are stuck on the update verification screen, actually, you can't go back to the settings or simply quit. So the first suggestion is to restart your iPhone. For iPhone 8 and later, press and hold volume up, then volume down and then hold down the side button until the Apple logo appears. Go to settings and try again after it boots. If it is still not working, then think about deleting the update you just downloaded and downloading it again. Simply go to settings and select general, and then select iPhone storage. The iOS 16 update is available here. Tap it to remove the update. Then return to the software update. Following the update check, you can reinstall the update. The third method is to check the status of your Wi-Fi. A failed iOS 16 update can occasionally be caused by a bad Wi-Fi connection. You can try resetting your network settings. When it boots, reconnect the Wi-Fi. Consider switching to another available Wi-Fi if you're having trouble with the current one. If you fail to verify the update with Wi-Fi, Try to disconnect it and use mobile data. That may also work. Also, ensure that the settings use both WLAN and mobile data. Things are much easier to solve if you have a computer. After you've connected your device to the computer, start iTunes. Click the check for update button in iTunes, and iTunes will update your iPhone to iOS 16. Very simple. You simply have to wait for the update progress to be completed. However, if an error occurs while you are using iTunes, as many users do, you should think about using a more convenient tool to update your iPhone to iOS 16. It's called Tenorshare Reiboot, which can resolve over 150 iOS system issues, including the updating problem. Look for the download link in the description below. And once downloaded, start Reiboot. Then hit Start. After that, select Standard Repair. Reiboot will automatically download iOS 16 firmware for you. There will be no data loss during the entire process, so there is no need for device backup. The entire procedure will take about 10 minutes. Simply be patient and keep your device connected. When you see the new hello screen appear on your device, that means your device has successfully updated to iOS 16. Congratulations! Let's take a look. I'll just skip over the settings and take you to the home screen. That's all. Some of the lock screen have simply changed. And then we go to the settings, and then go to the about page. As you can see, iOS 16 is now installed on your iPhone. Okay, so that's all for today's video. If it helps, don't forget to give us a thumbs up. I'll be very grateful if you subscribe. Stay tuned for our next video.